The name Chief Michael Adeoju might not ring a bell as much as his business empire, Elizade, which is a combination of his name and that of his much adored late wife, Elizabeth Wuraula Adeoju. Born June 14, 1938, at Ilara Moki, a town in Ondo State, into the family of the late Chief Solomon Ojo and Mrs. Beatrice Ademolawe Ojo, Chief Ade Ojo, who opened the gates of his prowling mansion in Ikeja to the Ovation crew, led by the general manager Shegwa Deboali, said his life as a child was filled with bristles and thorns, to the extent that he did not wear a pair of shoes until he was 15 years old. I know that. But I, I, I was working hard and um, God was so good that he was blessing me all along and um, today I advise anybody approaching me for any advice that you must try on the program. Be very careful with the scars in the Money is a scarce resource, and so you have to spend it very carefully. Before I can I can buy anything, I make sure that I'm able to afford that thing at least five times without uh, tampering with my capital. In fact. This self-made billionaire fondly called Mr. Toyota poured his life into building his empire and consistently deprived himself of necessities of life, even when he could afford them. The first time I, I went to um, London on first class, it was uh, the saddest day of my using the airplane. Because, yes, the, the, the seat was robust and big and they were serving me, you know, one quarter of what I could not consume. I am not a drinker and they were giving me hot drinks. I could not, I, I, so I was blaming myself. Why did I come to, to yes, if, if it is like this, why did I come? So I, then I thought, Half of the money I used for this class, if I gave it to a brother of mine or something to trade with, I said he should be able to make uh, some money for me. So because of that, I inflicted punishment on myself. I refused to, to use first class for five years. According to him, his foray into the business world was born out of a desire to succeed and make a name for himself and he credits his late wife as a pillar who ensured that the name Elizade, which spans investment in insurance, real estate, telecommunications, education and sport, apart from automobile, became entrenched in the business circuit. The, the first thing is that uh, I realized that to do business successfully, you must have the capital. So I did all I could to put my little savings together. And having succeeded in putting few um, amount of money together, I tried to manage it in the most prudent and frugal way. Some days ago, the business titan fondly called Mr. Toyota had every cause to thank God for joining the Octogenarian Club first with a praise concert. People refer to him as Mr. Toyota. Uh-huh. If you call him that, you won't be wrong. You still want to know who he is? Come with me. All those refer to him as Mr. Philanthropy. You still won't be wrong. And I'm sure you're wondering who I'm talking about. The man is none other than the business mogul, Chief Michael Adeoju.
everyone, my name is Bianca Ogoane. Ovation on TV is here at the Archbishop Vining Memorial Church Cathedral for the Thanksgiving service of Mr. Toyota. And it's none other than Chief Michael Adeojo. It's his 80th birthday today and he's here to give thanks to God. So now we'll go in and join in with the church service. And after the church service, we'll head straight to the reception. But then let's go in and thank God with him. It's his birthday. <laughs> The soulful Thanksgiving service was attended by family, friends, associates, and some leading lights of the Nigerian society who were led by the Vice President, His Excellency Professor Yemi Oshimbajo, and they included the governors of Ondo State, His Excellency Rotimia Keridolu, Governor of Oyo State, Senator Abiola Jimobi, and wife Florence, and former Governor of Ogun State, Otumba Gbenga Daniel, Otumba Michael Shibomi Balogo, Sir Kessentina Debutu, Senator Baba Femi Ujudu, Chairman of Federal Inland Revenue Service, Dr. Babatele Fowler, Prophet S.K. Abiara, Professor Bolaji Akinyemi, Pa Ayo Adebanjo, Professor Wale Omole, Chief Mrs. Bola Obasanjo, the Oshile Okiono of Egbaland, or Badeda Potejo Show, and his beautiful Oloris and retired General Ike Nwachuku. Let's 
Hours later, the 10 Degrees Event Center or Regon Lagos came alive as a befitting reception was hosted for guests. Top comedian Benga De Inka the first was a compare, while Wizkid and King Sonia Ade provided quality musical entertainment to the delight of some celebrated Nigerians, including own dusted governor Chief Rotimi Akeridolu, or shifted governor of Beni Rauf Arekweshola, chairman of Ovation Media Group Basharundeli Momodu. Others were Senator Daisy Danjuma, Irelu Abiola Dosumu, Irelu BC Faemi, and Nollywood actor Kunle Afolayo, amongst others. I wish him all the very best. I'm very happy that he has lived to reap the fruits of his many labors. I pray that God will bless him with more years full of grace, that all his children and his grandchildren will continue to do well. He is a very, very fortunate person, very highly blessed, but also very humble. Is a is a man that can fit into any class. Well, uh, well, the only thing you can wish the celebrant today, uh, normally, should be good health. Thank you. 